I almost feel like that I'm the space alien. I've been sent here to study human beings, to watch, to to basically just kind of figure out how you plan things out, how you activate, how you react, how you communicate. And it's like, wow, I could spend all day writing about just that emotion right there. I, I've seen in the front seat of that car. Or how people act and react while they're at work when they don't want to be there because we've spent the past two years remote working. I just want to watch. I learned so much being a student of life than being somebody who says, I've got this. I am super me. I ain't super me. I never will be. Took me a long time to realize that, but it's, it's just me. You know, people say, so, so you talk with all these people? Yeah. Why? Why? I don't know. I just, I show up and it's like, whoa, Brooke Shields, what are you doing? You're on my Zoom, Brooke Shields. How how is this possible? I just kept waiting for her to say, because you're a space alien and you like watching people because you feel like that there's something to learn from the human beings. Oh, there is. There is. Like, wow, this body, it it like ages it, it, it looks like it's goes from the baby stage and then you, you you go through your 20s and 30s you're looking good and then as you get older in your 60s and 70s it goes back to that baby stage you humans you humans <laughs> hey it's arrow this is the choice this is what i was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day today we're reading from december 9th 2022 i'm not sure why And why do we truly have to explain why? But we do. Almost like we're trying to fit in. Then again, maybe it's a parenting thing. Or we watch a lot of crime shows and we ask, why? Why did they do that? Why were they there? Why, 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 why? Well, research shows that it's to justify our choices. The attempt to connect or to step out of hiding a little bit further than where we were yesterday. This all stems from my early morning walk in the forest this morning. I wanted to know why I was noticing the late fall weather more than any other time. I was convinced I've never noticed fall like this. And then I began to laugh out loud because I didn't have true information to compare it to. Not until I dive into these 28 years of daily writing just to see if I am experiencing fall in a greater way than I've ever done. Because in that thought, oh, yes, I was. I was taking note of fall. The attempt to explain why to yourself can actually be just another brick in the wall. We rely so much on justifying our choices while attempting to connect or to step out. The fact that I recognize the season makes me grateful. It's about living in the presence. And obviously this morning, when I took note of noticing the fall weather, then I was in the present. And that's maybe what we need to do on an everyday basis. Just take note. You don't have to take notes. Just take note of where you are, recognize it, respect it, and learn from it. And, you know, if you have to ask why, I get it. Because I think that starts when we're two years old. Mom, why? And then when you're 15, mom, why? And then, and then when you're getting married, before you say I do, do not ever tell me you didn't say, why am I doing this? Did you? Are you being honest with me? Why? I'm Arrow, and that's what I was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day.